and welcome back to another episode of Lulu University. Um, so this week we're going to do something a little bit different. This is something that's really important to us here in the office, and we just want to we just want to attack it head on. Um, we're going to address some of the fake news that's been going around about self publishing. So stay tuned while we debunk some of the most popular myths about self publishing. Printing books is expensive. <laughs> it's not. Uh, it's about two dollars if you would print a six by nine trade paperback. Uh, and with Lulu, the publishing platform is completely free, so it costs nothing to publish your work. Self-publishing makes inventory the author's responsibility, bro. Wrong again! With self-publishing or print-on-demand technology, you can order one book or a hundred. You order them as you need, so no need to fill up your mom's basement with all your books. Self-publishing won't get my book to the masses. Do the masses want your book? It doesn't matter. With self-publishing, you can get it there. With ebooks and distribution, you can make your book available wherever your audience is. And with social media and all these technology platforms, you can talk to your audience directly, so there's no middleman. You only self-publish if you can't find a traditional publisher. Wrong again! You self-publish because you're smart, and with self-publishing, you're able to maintain complete control over your content, you have a much higher royalty split than with traditional publishing, and you can get your content to market way faster than going the traditional route. The quality isn't up to par. Arf. Oh, that's cute. And again, untrue. Years ago, you may have been able to make the argument that vanity presses or self-publishing wasn't creating the same quality of books. But nowadays, thank you to the advancement of technology, that's just not the case. Uh, and to be honest, uh, most large print houses, and I'll include Lulu in that, we're all drinking the same Kool-Aid. We're all using the same printers. And so it's virtually impossible to tell the difference between a self-published book and a traditionally published book. And if you are unsure, then I invite you, I encourage you to order a book off Lulu and check it out. Self-published authors don't make any money. Not that I care about money or whatever, but... Lulu has paid out over $8 million in royalties. So, I mean, <laughs> obviously somebody's making some money. But if you're not convinced, then stay tuned. And next week, we're going to dive into some success stories. And I'll give you all the juice goose about who's making money and how with self-publishing. Self-publishing is mad easy. OK, yeah, a little bit. A little bit of that's true. It's publishing with Lulu is a very simple and easy process. But creating the content to publish and creating something that's compelling that people are going to love and want is difficult. I mean, it's like any project that you undertake. You're going to need to do your research and really invest in it if you want to create something that you're proud of. But don't be afraid. We are always here to help. And we've got tons of resources for you guys to make sure that whatever you have in your mind on day one is what you have in your hand at the end of the process. Well, thanks for tuning in. I feel like we can all probably sleep easier tonight with a little bit less fake news going on in the world. But if there are any myths that we didn't debunk or that you want to ask about, leave them in the comments below. And be sure to subscribe because every week we're serving up hot, fresh tips and tricks for you guys. Tune in next week to when we talk about some real life people who are making real life money with real self-publishing. Get higher royalties and I can't remember the last one. Speed. Speed! You only self-publish if you cannot find a traditional publisher. <laughs> I don't know! Self-publishing is easy! You can only self- okay. Homie, the quality's not good. <laughs> I won't say homie, sorry. The quality effing sucks. The quality is terrible. The quality is whack. <laughs> this is my career, Ashley. I thought my range was a lot better than it is. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>